First off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekha Kudash. Thank the water Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, for allowing me to do another video through the Spirit. The water Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, for giving us his truth for his worms. Double items to our apostles and others at Great Millstone, and salutation and blessings to the overall elect. A little after work in transit, and uh, this, uh, I was thinking about this today at work that this world we live in is a huge rat race. Everyone is uh, chasing something, chasing a bag, chasing some pussy, chasing uh, chasing clothes, a nicer car, a house, whatever it may be. When this this uh this planet was meant to be made free, for people to be free to have freedom, chiefly the children of Israel, and and when I say free, I don't mean walking around butt ass naked. Everybody able to do what they will know. Free under the guidelines of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashem Shai, which is for man on earth. And it, anyways, it, it profits the earth. It's for the benefit of the planet earth. But people in this day and age, they look at the ways of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashem Shai, are being grievous on the planet now. The ways of the Lord are, are looked at as, as evil, and, and righteousness is looked at as good. I'm sorry, and wickedness is looked at as good and righteousness is looked at in a negative light. People look at look at it as if it's oppression or as oppressive. When it's when it only brings forth life. It's based off of life. It's a what what do people uh, the acronym for the Bible, the basic uh instructions before leaving the earth, something like that. Because the Bible is an instruction manual of how you're supposed to live on the planet. And when you get rid of that, look at what happens. Everyone's a slave. Everyone's a slave. It's mad. That's why there's rush hour at 5 o'clock every day. Because everyone's fucking slave. And very few people actually get to enjoy the wealth that they make. This world, this, this, this is not life, man. This is this is not living. Everyone's a slave, man. This man Esau has even enslaved his own people. Yeah, chiefly they had the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans in slavery. And, ch and hardcore slavery, but this man has made the entire planet Earth its slave. It's why the people, this is why the scriptures say the Earth languages and fades away, man. The haughty people, the Earth do language. This man has destroyed the fabric of life, man. He's destroyed life itself, and it's all, is you, man. It's no one else. It's no one else. It's you, Esau. It's you. You've gotten rid of sovereignty. No one's sovereign. Everyone has to go to you for everything. You, you you polluted the waters. You make people buy water. And Lamentation says you shall you shall uh, buy your water for money. You're not supposed to be spending money to get water. It's plenty. Of, this is the whole fucking planet is made out of water. But we spend money on water. Water should be free. You have you have you you can't you can't wander about without uh permission. You can't you can't have a horse. Unless the, the the devil allows you to, you can't have your own land. Unless the devil allows you to, you can't have no chicken. Unless the devil allows you to, you can't have you can't have nothing, man. He's enslaved the entire planet Earth, man. Esau is to be blamed for this. It's him, and it's only him. He's the one that's done this. What? He's the one that's done this. No one else. The other nations, you could, when they were in power, they, you would have to pay tribute to them, of course. But you would have your sovereignty still. You could go, you could go about. You, you could walk around <laughs> without, without the devil <laughs> coming around and police. What you doing? What, hey, what you doing? You working, boy? You, you, you working? Nah, man. This man in Esau, you got, you have to go, man. You, that even your own people are through, man. I'm looking at e Mike right now, driving. Motherfucker's finished. Cracked out, drugged out. He's oppressed. He's fucking, he's fucking tired of, of his own people's bullshit. And he probably still proud as ever. Something's wrong with you, man. Something's seriously wrong with the so-called white man. And, and, it, and it's a way the Heavenly Father made him. Yes. For you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, this man is the devil. He enslaved you, man. And he continues to oppress and beat you down, man. To your nothing. This is why the scriptures say that he wore out the saints of the Most High. This man will beat the planet.
planet Earth to its end. He will destroy the children of Israel to its end. Then he'll just go after the rest of the planet Earth. But there will be no. It's, that's why the scriptures say no flesh will be saved if it weren't for the elect. This man would kill everything. He would destroy everything. This is why he's not ever. This is why he will not make it to other to other planets in 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 this on this go around because you're gonna make it to other planets, motherfucker. You will make it to other planets. Yes, you will. You gotta build shit on the planet. You gotta build things for the for the for the righteous nation. But you you being in power, being able to tell people yes or no, you, that's just gonna stop. You will, you will lose that power. The Lord is gonna strip you from your throne, man. And, and he and he has to, man. He has to strip the so-called white man from it, from their throne because he he does not know how to rule. He, he was only made to be the whipping stick, to be the sword of the earth, just like he was blessed with in Revelation 6. And even before that, in Isaiah, man, not Gen Genesis, Isaac blesses man with the fucking sword, man. He's been blessed with the sword. He's been endowed with the sword, so he goes around through the earth utilizing it. He doesn't know how to keep peace. He doesn't know how to... to Till the land. He doesn't, he doesn't know how to do these things, man. This man is a man of war. That's all he does. Goes out, hunts, kills, and destroys and pillage. That's it. He doesn't know how to rule. And you can see it through the fruits of the world. Look at the way everybody's fucking talking about it, they, she, e, non binaries, fucking, fucking P's and LGBTs and and, and this confusion, man, and it's being accepted on a mass level. It's being accepted on a mass fucking level, man. And they know not to do this. They know. They have the books. They have the scrolls. They have the writings. That 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 this is not how the world is supposed to be ran. And, and that every time it's been ran like this, the Heavenly Father has taken that kingdom out of power. It's just that simple, man. But no, Esau will do what he wants. He, he, this is, this is who, this is a man who strives against God. He fights against God himself, and he's gonna be put down like a fucking ant, man. Because you think you're God, you think you can, you think you can dance with the Most High, but you can't. You can't dance with the Most High. You can't box with the Most High. Yeah, how about Shimmy Al Shai is gonna take you down, baby? He gonna take you down, and and, and to rejoice. And the elect of Yahweh Bashim Shai and the righteous will rejoice at the destruction of the so called white man. And you niggas that's not with it, you black women that's not with it, you black men that's not with it, you so called Negro men, you so called Latino men, you so called Latino women. If you, if you not for the destruction of the so called white man, you will go right along with them and we will rejoice over you also, Lord willing. We be a part of that number. It's going to. We're going to. We're not going to care about the, whoever the, the elect of the Lord will rejoice in the destruction of the wicked. That's a goddamn fact. Because righteousness needs to flourish throughout the planet Earth. Righteousness needs to flourish. It's not a want. It's not a want, man. It's a need. The planet Earth is in need of new management. It needs help, man. It needs help. The planet is, is is sick, man. It's dying. And, and if Esau fucking stays in power, he would fucking kill it. He would destroy the planet. And then go to the next one and do it all over again. This is the type of man we're dealing with. And this is this is the type of man who the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shemal Shai, is going to stop himself. He established him and he's gonna take him out of power. So Lord will hope this lesson was edifying. I want to give all praises to you. How about Shimei Al Shai? Bye, Shimei Kakadash. And with that, Shalom.